everyone. Welcome back to another Kevin's Creations here on Geektopia Island. I'm Kevin. I'm Cardwell. And as always, we're back with a new deck tech. This one's going to be pretty fun. It's an old ruler. It's one of the old Divinity rulers. It's our boy Fushai. Yeah. We're playing him again. Uh, before we get into the deck, though, we remind you that we do have a Patreon. The link will be down below. Go check it out. It really just takes an extra dollar to give us some love and support, and we would greatly appreciate it. With that, let's delve into the Dragon's Dogma, which oh, yeah. is the name of the deck. And it's really just about dragons. It's the, the, the divinity of dragons, and that's where we're at. Nice. So, our boy Fushai, he's got Divinity 10, Judgments for 2 red and 3, and Energizes for a red. Super simple. Yep. And, Remember those days? Yeah, I know, right? Simple rulers, great. And then Divinity 10, and he's a 10-10 flyer on when he Judgments. And he enters, you search your deck for a dragon with total cost 4 or less, and put it into the field. That's what he does. Simple. It's solid. Simple. It's simple as that. You pay 5 mana, you get... At least two dudes in play. Yeah. Seems strong. So, first up, his divinity rules, or his divinity runes. things that I have, runes. Yeah. First up is Sendora's Invasion. It is two red and three, but it costs one less to play from a rune area, so it's four mana. Look at the top five cards of your deck. You may put a fire resonator with total cost one, fire resonator two, and a fire resonator three from among them into the field. It's and or, so you can choose any number of them, but hopefully you get one, two, and three. Yeah. And then you put the rest on the bottom of your deck in a random order. So, sweet. Let's just get three dudes for four. That's pretty yep. good. Next up is Power of Immortality. You're playing black, you're gonna do it. Yep. It's one black and one. Costs one less for maroon areas, so it's one black, quick cast. Uh, target Resonator gets plus four, plus zero, oh, and then when this card is put into the graveyard from the field, you put it back into play under your control. It's so annoying to play against yeah. every time. Because if you're playing against it, you've got to know they're gonna do it. You just gotta, you just gotta respect it, because otherwise it's gonna catch you. Oh yeah, definitely for sure. And then we have his master rune, which is Flame Soldier Formation. It is a red and X quick cast. Play only if your ruler is Fushai. Choose one. Target X Resonator, J Resonators that cannot attack or block until the end of turn, or search your deck for a Fire Resonator with total cost X or less and put it into the field. And this mode is actually gonna be good for either one in this deck because yeah. you're really kind of aggro. So if you want to just make them not block for a turn, you're like those dudes don't block. Kill you. You win the game, yeah. Yeah, or you can go get a dude. Next up is Explosion. It is one red, quick cast, rune. This card deals 700 to a target attacking or blocking resonator. So you're just like, cool. I one mana, kill your dude. Yep. Seems good. And finally, the last rune we got is Sand Awakening. It is one red, quick cast, chant rune. You pay a red less to play this rune area. So you only need one mana. And then target resonator gets plus two, plus six. If it is red, it gets plus four, plus eight instead. Oh yeah. So, this card literally can target all the dudes in the deck except for one and give it plus four, plus eight because most of the dudes are red. And that's pretty much where we're at on that. Yep, seems simple, seems awesome. The uh, first resonator we have is Numbing Hedgehog. It's one red, four, four, enter. Target resonator can't block until in a turn. And if you've never played an aggro deck, you don't understand how great this is. Yeah, just you're just like, hey, don't block. They play, they swing out, they try to race you, and then they play their dude to defend, and then you're like, no. That yeah. one dude to defend, it doesn't matter. Next up is Guinevere, the Jealous Queen. She has one red, and she has an active, she has a 2-4, and you can tap, banish your resonator to draw two cards, then discard a card. So, solid. Yep. And then you can pay a red and tap, target resonator you control gets plus four, plus four until the end of turn, and then when it deals the or just dealt damage this turn, banish it. So it can pump up one of your dudes really angry really quickly and kill something, or one of their dudes if you want to, but mostly you're going to use that to draw cards and just keep filtering through so you get more aggro. Exactly, and if you know your dude's going to die, you might as well trade it off anyway with her. Just yeah. like, my dude gets big and they're dead and all that fun stuff. This one, the Darkest Fire Small Dragon. <laughs> Best name ever, it's a darkness in red for a 6-6 flying dragon. When this card is put in the graveyard from the field, destroy target damage resonator, which is pretty awesome. That's, that's really all he does. Yeah, that's really all he does. I mean, he has other abilities for shock team, right. but we're not playing her, so it doesn't matter. Yep. But he's one of the ones that you want to die because he gets to kill a dude when he dies. So. Next up is Orpheus, the Immoral Player. He is two black for a 6-5 zombie, and you can pay a black or remove a resonator in your graveyard from the game, put a 2-2 zombie into play. So all those dudes you sacrifice, you could use them again and make more dudes. Yeah, and the fact that you just... That's why he's a player for sure, because he just yeah. brings all the boys to his yard. <laughs> the next one is the Darkest Fire Dragon. Not the smallest one, but the darkest. It's a dark red N1. It's an 8-8 flying. 
This card gains swiftness as long as you turn, uh, control Volga the Fire King. But enter. Destroy target damage resonator if you do put two 1-1 one -one counters on this guy. Which makes him a 10-10. Yeah. So you know they're going to block. And so therefore you get that. Next up is Peng Tong. And it is two red and one for a 4-8 uh, human. Look at the top four of your deck. You may reveal a fire card from among them and put it into your hand. Put the rest on the bottom of your deck in a random order. Mainly it's just there to help you dig some more if you need to. And it's there for another card that we'll get to. Next one is Dragon of Kulon. That's flying. And when this card enters the field from your deck, so obviously from your Jay Ruler, it deals 1,000 damage to your target Jay Resonator. And he's a 12-12 for four flying. Yeah. Insane. Strong, yeah. strong. He's super good. Yeah. Next up is Blazer. He's another good target for your J ruler to get. Yep. He has two red and two black for a 10-10 fire. Target J slash resonator your opponent controls, loses all abilities until the end of the turn, then destroy it. If a J ruler was destroyed this way, the ruler your opponent controls loses all abilities. So if they have a ruler, you're just like, cool judgment, go get Blazer, kill your J, yeah. and you don't get your front side abilities. Thanks. Yeah, it's insane and powerful in the fact that there are those moments when you do go back and forth like, okay, you flip your J, I'm going to flip mine. Well, yours basically kills theirs, yeah. so they lose value yeah. altogether. This one is Q Lane. It's a 2 red and 2, 9-9. Nine, nine. Human. Enter. Search your deck for a name, Ping Tong, which we do. Reveal it and put it in your hand. Shuffle your deck. Rune 4. Enter. You may put a card name, Ping Tong, from your hand to the field so it can be free. Or Rune 4 as well. Tap, banish another resonator, cancel target chance spell, which is very powerful. It is very powerful because that can help you get rid of the super burning beast rush. Yeah. I did. You have to survive long enough through that, but if you get there, you're just like, hey, no, stop yeah, it. No, don't, don't, don't do all that shenanigans. Yeah. Uh, next up is the couple spells we have. Not a whole lot, but they're here. And we got Liquid Corruption because it's a really good discard spell. Yep. Uh, one black, look at your opponent's hand, choose a card with four or less, they discard that card. If you awaken this for two, you get a five and, a, five and up as well. But really, you just want to do it turn one or turn two and get whatever you want. Yeah. Mainly Regalias, for sure. Yeah. Or Super Burning Rush, just yeah, like... Yeah, you don't have out. much of an answer for those. Yeah. Of course, and now we have Life Severing Blade, one of the old classics. It's a quick cast, uh, black and two. If a Resonator you control is put in the graveyard from the field this turn, you may pay two less to play this card. So for one darkness, you destroy target Resonator. Yeah. Yeah. And with Guinevere, you're drawing cards already by sacking dudes, so you might as well kill a dude. Too. Yeah, exactly. Uh, the stones are really simple. We have some darkness magic stones, we have fire magic stones, and then we have some other magic stones, Scorch Bales, which is the split stone that does either or. Uh, it, it's very simple, straightforward, red, black, aggro. Yeah. And that's really what we're doing. That's all you need. <laughs> I need to try to kill you really, really quick. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but that is the deck. The deck list will be down below. Check it out. Give us some likes and comments in the down below, and we will see you all again next time. Goodbye. Also, guys, I just remind y'all to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and if you want to keep up to date on all our future content, make sure you click that bell. It will give you all the notifications you need. With that, we'd like to go ahead and give a big thank you to all our fans that support us through the year, and especially our Patreon support people. Uh, we do like to give a shout-out to our Mythic and Above uh, supporters, and that would be Dwayne Higgs. Thank, thank you very you much. much. We love you.